Chirima Vanessa will be bringing more good news to Nigeria, guys. This is clear fact. You understand? Hey, guys, this is not a joke. And it is already definitely clear that South Africa will regret why they chase Chidima Vanessa away. They will regret. It's haunting them. It will not stop haunting them. Many of them are now all over the world defending themselves. Oh, we just want everybody to go to their country. We just want all Nigerians to go to their country and fix their country. Blah, blah, blah. Why don't you want Chinese to go to their country and fix their country? Why don't you want Indians to go back to their country and fix their country? Why don't you want other immigrants that are not Africans to go back to their country? It's only African immigrants you want them to go to their country. You cannot justify this xenophobia. You just have no reasons. You cannot justify the reason. The pure hate is visible. You just didn't want her because she's a Nigerian. She even came out to speak on interviews telling the world the origin of the problem. Chidima made an interview where she disclosed the origin of the problem that Chidima Vanessa was having with South Africa. Chidima said that the origin, all of this problem started because her name was Chidima. That's all. So the whole issue started because her name was Chidima. South Africans were like, why will your name be Chidima and you want to win me South Africa? Why? So the, the, the problem was not really her nationality. It was just the fact that the name sound Nigerian. And so it gave them that fear. It, it, it arose that inferiority complex in them. That stigmatization. It made them to look like, oh, so now you have a Nigerian name, eh? You want to come and run for me, South Africa. That's how it all started. And when she was running, they thought she would not win. So they were having no problem. So the moment they saw her going closer to winning, that's when the xenophobia intensified, the hate intensified, and they had to chase her away. And now they are regretting. And South Africa will regret even more. South Africa has so many reasons to regret chasing Chidima Vanessa away. And the reasons keep coming. The reasons keep adding and adding and adding, despite the fact that South Africa has already been embarrassed. And there's nothing you guys can do to justify and clear your image or clear your name. It's not going to change until you people really change and stop treating Nigerians the way you do. Until you people finally change and stop treating African immigrants the way you do. Forget this your story of we don't hate them. We just want them to go back to their country and fix their country. This is Africa. No Africa is a foreigner in Africa. No African can be regarded as a foreigner in Africa. Nigeria holds that principle. That's why you never hear of foreigners in Nigeria. You never hear of, oh, these are foreigners in this country, these are foreigners in this country. You never hear that in Nigeria. But you think there are no foreigners there. They are there. There are more foreigners in Nigeria than in South Africa. There are more African immigrants from different countries in Nigeria than in South Africa. But you will never hear that. I will show you. Like I said before, you will see. Just be watching. They follow. Don't quit because I will show you all the details. But guys, I want to tell you guys of these great advantages and the great good news that Chidima will be bringing to Nigeria. As you can see, there's already a statement coming out to declare that Nigeria will officially host 2025 Miss Universe should in case Chidima Vanessa wins this 2024 Miss Universe in Mexico. So you see that the advantages that Chidima is bringing to Nigeria, they keep adding up. They keep adding up. And we can clearly see that she is already the favorite. We don't even know who are the contestants yet for Miss Universe in Mexico. But we already know Chidima. And Chidima Vanessa is already popular across the world. Amongst all the contestants right now, nobody has the fame. Nobody has the audience. Nobody has the popularity of Chidima Vanessa. She is most, more popular than any other contestant in the world right now. So it is putting her on a straight advantage. She just needs to capitalize on all the story, all the things that have happened, everything that is going on around her. They just need to put the story out in the right way, get the right emotion out there, you know, play the Nigerian emotional card, Get everybody on board and you will see how it will go down. <laughs> Nigeria has enough people around the world to support. Nigeria has enough audience. You can see where 
you can see when Nigeria decides to follow and support somebody, you see the results. Eh? You see what is happening to Victor Osimen leaving Napoli to Galatasaray in Turkey. You see how many followers that the Napoli team is losing on social media. They are losing millions of followers. And out of a sudden, uh, Galatasaray is getting millions of followers. That's the Nigeria spirit. So that spirit, if that spirit follow Chidima Vanessa, forget it. She's a winner. She's going to definitely be bringing the trophy home to Nigeria. I'm not saying Africa anymore. Let Africa stay in their country. Nigerians don't need them. Nigeria should focus on Nigeria and make Nigeria look great. And when Nigeria is great, nobody should come there. Nobody should enter. That's how I agree Nigeria should run it. Because if they are going to treat Nigerians the way they are treating Nigeria, then Nigeria should also give them that same treatment. Wutu, wutu. You get the point? Yes. Chidima Vanessa is a big advantage for Nigeria. And she's bringing lots of good news for Nigeria. Lots of great things coming to Nigeria because of Chidima Vanessa. So her win would definitely mean that Nigeria will be hosting Miss Universe World. As in America, Europe, everybody will come to Nigeria to come and compete for the Miss World Championship title. You understand? That's how it's going to go down. But what will South Africa gain on the other hand? We all know their Mumu person will win anything. Their Mumu lady will not win. Their Mumu lady is just going there because she has to go. And South Africa will lose the great talents in Chidima Vanessa. Lose all the advantages that they had. Lose many talents. Lose credibility. I mean, lose a good name and all of that just because of negative energy towards one beautiful lady that is going to represent Nigeria at the world stage. Guys, I'm happy for Chidima Vanessa. I'm happy for Nigerians. I can only celebrate and I can't wait. And right now, Nigerians, we need to start thinking and working how we can vote for Chidima, how we can rally to support Chidima and win Miss Universe in Mexico. Chidima must win and make Nigeria proud. South Africans will finally close their mouth. It's not far. It's in November. <laughs> November at the corner. So guys, just be preparing. Eh? There's no time to waste because we have a point to prove. It is what it is. Your boy Ajay Maxi on this one again. Smash the like button. Smash the notification bell. Come back anytime you're free, guys. It's a 